32. Praising the Wicked Proverbs 28.4 tells us plainly, Those who forsake the law praise the wicked. New King James Version To abandon God's law and word is a way of praising evil men. Closely tied to this is Proverbs 29.18 Where there is no vision the people perish, but he that keepeth the law happy is he. The word vision can be translated as prophecy or revelation. Perish in the marginal reading is very literally, is made naked. Without God's revelation, without the Bible, a people are left stripped or naked, defenceless, therefore ready to perish. But he that keepeth the law, happy is he. What we are here told is that God's word is our true armour and covering. Without its protection, we run coverless, naked, in the face of life's problems and our enemies, we perish. Thus, to abandon God's word is in effect to praise the wicked, to justify them in their contempt for God and his word. Having thereby praised the wicked, we ourselves run naked, we strip ourselves of our only true defence, and we make God our enemy. As against this, all who live by God's law word are happy or blessed. Someone gives us a commentary on these verses, as well as introducing the Psalter. It tells us the future of those whose delight is in the law of the Lord, as against the future of the ungodly. As individuals and as a nation, we had better listen.